Hello all, I'm Jack Higgins and this is another Earthworks 2 Minute Turf Talk, so let's get right to it. What is the last thing you think about before you go to sleep and the first thing you think about waking up in the morning as a turf manager? It's roots. It's what we're all about. We know that it's roots that are going to get us through the summertime. Well, in the recent Earthworks podcast, Joel Simmons was interviewing Armin Suni, and Armin put it best. Listen here. So. What you have in the middle of May is what you have. Yeah. yeah, exactly. So it's that time of year, and what we have in the ground is what we're going to have to get us through the summertime. So let's make the most of it. Let's first of all talk about how did we get the roots to begin with. We got a number of root pictures in our Twitter feed in the last couple of weeks, one from our, my buddy, Ryan Merriman out east on Long Island at East Hampton, and another one from a good friend down in Roanoke, Stephen Ball at Ballyhack. And what these guys did to achieve these giant root masses were really attack the airification program, get that foundation down in the ground, part of which was the Earthworks Myco Replenish, Myco 333. Those mycorrhizae spores instantly populate and attach themselves to the root system so that you extend that root system, help you get through the summertime. There's strategies to do that outside of aerification, maybe a little needle tine and a dusting of five pounds per thousand of, of, of micro replenish. Uh, beyond that, we need to focus further on roots with our, with our liquid applications, C3, reducing sodium, knowing what the limitations are against roots, bicarbonate crust, reducing that. These are the ways that we will grow roots moving in through the summertime because what we have now is what we're going to have. We need to maintain it. So thank you all and have a good summer. <laughs>